Hello, we would like to introduce a compact and high-function LCD panel tester called as, called as PG, PGL series. There are two types of testers. One is for testing LVDS panel, another is for EDP4 lane panel. At this time, we would like to provide immediate film for a PGL LVDS type of tester. Especially, it is showing a film with a LCD TV panel, panel with advanced. Okay, let's see the brief, brief specification. Um, it has slim and portable size. It, the resolution is max to 2560 and 1600. Uh, it has 6, 8, 10-bits LVDS output and can control 120Hz with 4-channel LVDS, of, LVDS output. Uh, also, it has... Also, it can... It is EEPROM readable and writable. And can test ver ver variable monitors with 46 installed patterns, including two pieces of 3D patterns. Uh, especially auto run, auto run is operating when LCM LCM aging test. Uh, especially especially when it's testing tablet display from Retina, Retina, 3D, or etc. PGL series package could could be helpful helpful for you. Okay, I'll show you. Okay, this is PGL tester pattern generator. You can see the LCM voltage select jumper at the top, and you can connect the. 12 volt, 5 volt, and 3.5 volt panel each. Um, on left, there is on off switch. You can connect 12, 12 volt power supply. There, there is auto run and it turns pattern pattern automatically, but the, but the delay time adjuster is available. Even if just showing the details in film, there's there's numbers and this shows the inter interval time when operating each pattern. There's EEPROM and it can read EEPROM data, and when it push it when you put the button at once, it shows the EEPROM data on the screen and it it just disappears when it push it again. There's server socket. You, you don't have to. You don't have to be careful. And there, it show it shows the value of dip switch setting about the test, tested LCM, and it shows the pattern number number. This dip switch is based on user manual. It can be set each dip switch's position. Um, okay, let's see this side. There's LD, LVDS channel 1, 2, and you can connect to full HD a, or HD cable. Uh, there, 120 20 Hz cable can can use this, this channel 3, 4. Okay, there, there's service socket for the inverter, but you don't have to. You don't have to be. Never mind it. Okay, this equipment is pa pattern generator to drive panels, so you have to you have to operate with additional inverter. I'll show you how to switch on the panel. Uh, okay, this panel is 47 inch LG panel with 120 hertz. So there are two cables. One is one is LVDS channel one two, and the other is channel three four. Um, okay. Uh, keep in mind that you have to connect the cable with label to panel, and to connect the other cable without label to, to the device. Okay. Now we we are linked each cables with each channel side one, two, and three, four. Um, power supply is linked. Okay, according to user manual, I I set this switch to 100 hertz. Power up. I operate the inverter. Inverter. Okay, when I turn the switch on, the pattern screen is showing. 
when I push the pattern change button up and down, each each pattern shows differences. Yeah. Uh, as I indicated, if you push the E from button once, it shows tested panel value of hex. And you have to push once again to re reoperate the reoperate the pattern. Yeah, thank you for listening.